Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, and welcome back to Food Street for the Hoppy Spring event. Started on March 21st and will continue to the 27th, and it's your chance to work with your team towards getting top scores. Welcome, MXC and Mary F. I see you here in the chat, but let's bring up Red Knight and say hello as well. Hello as well, everybody. It's me, as you can see. We've got this gorgeous event on at the moment with some wonderful spring dishes. Now, this is your chance to start producing lots of goods because once you produce those goods then you can start collecting more and doing more within the game so let's go and play well there's the event area as you know i've already started today lawanda nada hello as well good to see you here as well mxc says please can you do heyday soon i did heyday yesterday for about um three or four hours on my channel so you need to go to my first channel for the heyday videos um, that one's already done I won't be doing that today so I will be doing some other videos today but different thing but yeah so that one's already done did that last night for many 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 hours with all of the viewers and even gave away some farm passes but this one's a different game another one that I like playing Right now, when you start producing some goods as usual, you need a lot of greens and a lot of uh, chicken pieces with this one. So, definitely time to get the old crops going and get those legs on the go. We got a few pieces down there started already, so I better get some more in there as well. Go collect those crops as well, and then start with the tomatoes. And I think we do some wheat as well. I got some milk down there which will take me towards one of my tasks which is good and I like that one maybe get some more milk on the go as I blitz this and do some ham later I won't stay long because I'm waiting for my prayer and was busy day to day no problems nada uh, the time zone is definitely different for you and don't worry today I have no snacks just water so you're safe from my eating habits yeah <laughs> got no Kit Kats MXC, if you want to give this game a go, please do so. Uh, every week we do this one on a, uh, a Saturday morning, and the games company also gives me some items to give away. So a good chance to win some nice little pieces just to expand on the game and uh, make it a little bit easier and more fun. But it is more challenging, definitely, so please be aware of that. There's a lot more involved with this game that are uh, very different from the other game. Right, Peter, my friend, good to have you here as well. Strictly, I see you in the chat as well. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, we can get some pineapple on the go for this one. I need some saws, I think, as I'm running out. Let's see if we can work on getting some of those today as well. All right, we trash that one down there. Do I have the pizza? Yes, I do. And there we go. That should be another task done. Oh, I like that. Don't you like that when things get done rather quickly? Let's trash the other ones I can't do. Let's keep the ones I can do. One, two down there. I need one. Tomato soup I need to produce as well. We we'll get some of those on the go. There we go. Lovely as well. Yeah, mint breeze. I think I can do that one if I got the honey. Let's have a look. No, I don't. Oh well. So mint breeze, good buy coffee I should have some on the go yes I do lovely there we go another set of points right just finished my snack just water now Shelly is stalking me says Peter really oh dear so Shelly I understand you're stalking Peter wow <clears throat> all right well let's put these tables away they're now finished with their collection so I'm going to put that one into storage, that one into storage, and that one into storage. Now, did anybody notice that we've got some brand new tiles within the game? <clears throat> They've added in some bunny tiles, um, which are unlockable for 250 gold coins. 
Now it's been a while since we've had new tiles added into the game. We do have a lot down there that you purchase for different themes and different events which is very nice indeed. There are some that you can get through the game by using your actual uh, vouchers but it's uh, very nice to see that we've actually got some tiles down there that are uh, new for the theme. There are a lot down there that I do like and some that I haven't yet purchased that I would love to do so. Like I love the geometric stone. I might get that one sooner rather than later. But yes, we got brand new tiles to go with all of our others down there. Now, it's a shame that they are all out of alphabetical order. And as usual, you've got to slide up and down just to see what you want. But new tiles is very nice indeed. Peter says, I feel so loved. That's good. Hmm. Mary Beth said today, baked zitty tonight with garlic bread. Oh, that sounds nice. That does. That does. I'd like to try that one myself. <coughs> My dinner last night, I had two pieces of fried chicken breast, uh, some chicken nuggets and chips uh, with uh, rice balls, little mini vegetables, uh, some pork cutlets, uh, and uh, some sweet beans. It was nice. I enjoyed that one. I enjoyed that one. And I chatted with one of my friends who I often meet at the, the supermarket, which was good as well. So, yes. So, today I haven't eaten yet, so I will do that a little bit later. But I'm still umming and ahhing what to do for lunch. So, should I do something big or something small? But that will be later. Definitely, 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 definitely. It did. It was delicious. Yeah. I like to mix and match the food that I get sometimes. And it can be very handy doing that as well. Now, I'm going to need a lot of chocolate bunnies as usual with this one. So, let's start blitzing some of those bunnies as well. We are going to need some of these other pieces made. So, we'll cycle through these ones as well. And see if we can get some of these pieces on the go. And we'll start progressing more. Now, down here, there's slots that need to be open, but I need tokens. Now, do I need to spend my tokens to buy something? Well, first of all, let's go looking. Now, stoves, I can't buy any of those, even though I'm getting closer again. Um, in relation to the egg table, what have I got? Now, these are my current tables at the moment, so we'll stick those back into storage for the moment. Let's see, do we have anything that needs to be purchased, I wonder. In fact, before I do this, let's go active, copy that one, place that one over to there. Now we've got a special area, so let's bring out some of those tables. There's 600 gold coins for the egg table. Ooh, I think we've got to do this, don't you? There we go. Now oh, they take up four spaces. Interesting. I've got the garden table from before, which is that one there. I've also got the spring table down there as well, which is very nice indeed. And then there's the earth table as well, which I've got from previous events, which is also very nice. So those are the table collections. If I do the earth table, how much did that one cost? Let's find out. That one won't tell me for the moment. Hang on, let's put that one back in storage. How much was the cost on those tables? I don't remember. So, two in inventory. I go back in that one as well. 500 gold coins for earth tables. Okay, let's go do this. So, the earth table is 500 coins. Let's go purchase all of the earth tables. There we go. We've got nine tables now, it says. That seems a bit strange. There we go. There's three over there. Forgot to put those in. All right, now we should have space to buy the rest of the tables. There we go. Yep, spending my money. 
One set of earth tables purchased and added to the game. Right, what's a samurai burger? Ah, samurai burger, the one I had yesterday, was basically burger with bacon and a few other bits inside. But I didn't enjoy it, not really. Teriyaki burger is much nicer. The sauce is definitely very different. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Do, 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 do. Okay, hang on a second. Let me go find it. Uh, maybe this one will be good. Damn, Japanese yen's dropping again. <laughs> do, 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 do. Hang on a sec, Pete. <laughs> That's a Samurai Mac burger. So depending on the one you want, uh, there are different ones, so there you go. Trouble is though, I think the wrapper said Samurai, but the contents wasn't. There we go. That's the one I had. The roasted soy sauce, bacon, tomato, thick beef burger. Um, so mine had the bacon and the cheese on the bottom. So there we go. That was my one. There. That's the samurai burger. So that's the one I had. So roasted soy sauce, bacon, tomato, thick beef burger. And it was very nice. Mm. And there's the other one, which is the thick beef burger. So with a double burger and a double cheese, but no bacon. So very nice indeed. That's what it looks like. And then there was the the, the floats as well, if you fancied one of those. So, but that's what it looks like. There you go, Pete. Mm -mm -mm. That's what I had for lunch yesterday. Um, so after I finished work, my mate and I went to McDonald's and uh, yeah, we had a McDonald's. So yes, it was okay, but I didn't taste it. Tasted strange this time. It doesn't usually taste like that. So, mm, you want to take a bite? Go on then. There's a big burger there. I'm sure you would be okay. So yeah, look at that. I do like burgers. Come on. Cancel that one. Don't need that one. Keep that one. I keep open. That's what we were talking about yesterday. So no problems. Okay, that's good as well. Yep. I had the burger, the Coke, uh, I had fries, uh, and one of their sweets, which was very nice. My friend had a, a Big Mac, I think it was, maybe, oh, or one of the burgers there. Fries, a Coke, a chicken piece, so, and a salad. Mm. It was nice. Right, so that is the table. That's one of them. That's the Earth Day table. I've now got nine in storage, so we can stick those back away. Let's uh, go hide those again. Actually, I can do it all this way, kind of. It'll be easier. There we go. I love this option to be able to put away in one go. It makes it so much easier. The next one down there is the spring table. Yeah, I've got eight of those. It will let me buy nine but now if I wanted to because the game's been updated. So that's 400 gold coins on that one, which is very nice indeed. So a pretty blue one if you want to get it. Yeah, very nice indeed as well. Did I get into the wrong stream? No, 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 no. Definitely got one for food. <laughs> Stupid internet slow today. Yeah, I had problems with the internet as well. And uh, Heyday crashed my game today as well with their new pop-up for um, the advertisements. I started to record to make a video on that as well. And then it uh, crashed on me. And I don't know if it accepted or not accepted, so... I've got to ask behind the scenes on that one. 
Next one down there is the garden table. Now that one is vouchers, so I'm probably not going to get that one. I'm going to stick with the single piece on that one. So one table, no vouchers. Mm. What makes it samurai versus the regular? The source strictly at the end of the day. Um, it's often about the sauce um, and how it's cooked. So definitely very different on that side. So in some ways McDonald's is kind of like a Kit Kat in that they're always changing their menus here in Japan. So they have their regular items and then they have very different ones as well. So it's not quite the same when it comes down to food sometimes. So you can get your regular items and then they have their special items which you might not see in other countries. And most countries are like that so you'll visit and they have different selection of menu. Like if I go back to England, let's say I have a McDonald's, it's very different in McDonald's now than it is here. Different kid sets, different toys, um, different kinds of burgers, different cleanliness, um, different colour scheme. So, <laughs> very different indeed. Well, there's the Easter table. I definitely want to get some more of those egg tables. They are kind of cool, so... I knew I was going to have no coinage left after today again. So all that beautiful money I've been building back up again to get my machine has now disappeared. There we go, one more time. They vanish from the game. And I kind of like that. Those tables do look nice. I think if I'm going to place them out, um, maybe a fence style is much better. They're kind of like mushrooms and um, eggs around them. I think if I glitch them together, Actually, glitching them together could be so much better. Hang on, we got to test this. So, we're going to copy that one over into there for the moment, just to keep it in place. Let's bring out the item I use for glitching. So, indoor decoration piece, let's find it. Where's the machine? Let's see, how do they look when they're blended in together? That's going to be the one to decide if it's a nice piece to keep. There we go. That's the machine. Oh, I didn't place it, you idiot. Let's see what they look like when they're jumbled together. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Did I go past? I think maybe I did. Let's go back up again. Where is it? There it is. I did go past. So place it down first. Right now, I think I am going to put that one. No, we'll leave it down here. So, I move this table out of the way for the moment. We put that one into there and then let's go glitch that table in together and see what it looks like. So we put that one back into storage. I'm um, also having a glass of wine and a joint of Marana cards, so I'm good. Ricky in Japan, did Kit Kats have special editions for Easter? They do, yes. Uh, they do have special ones for Easter as well. And they look like uh, little rabbits or chicks, depending on the one you go for. And they're also different flavors. So, very nice indeed. We bring that one back out, close off the game, come back to the main one. We can now bring the table into that position. Then we copy this one again, copy that one over into there, yes. Edit that mode. Right, that machine is now there. We take that out, put that back into storage, come back out one more time. Bring that down above, close that off, come back to the main one, and bring the table over, there we go, place that down, oh it looks good, look at that, that does look nice doesn't it? So you've got a choice with the tables if you wanted to. You can uh, glitch them in together and make some different patterns depending on your style or preference. So, what are you going to choose, I wonder? 
folder. Mm. We can also have a little bit of fun and maybe connect the tables in so they go longer. Yeah, okay, let's have a look at that one. Right, so I'm going to do this again. Copy that one over into there. Edit that mode. Come back again. Right, this time I'm going to put that into uh, storage. There we go. Bring that one out. Oh, sorry. I could extend this table quite nicely. That looks kind of funny. An hidden Easter under the table. Ricky, I might come to Japan next year to watch the Bikini Bodybuilders. Really? Okay, you have to tell me and we could meet up. Depending on where the Bikini Bodybuilder event is, of course. And uh, Japan has some um, very beautiful and uh, physically attractive bodybuilders. Uh, they do, so definitely uh, worth watching. Oh, yes. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, both male and female. There we go. Let's take away that stand for the moment. And then we're going to push that off to the side since I don't need that for this now. Place that one down there. We can squeeze that one into there and then maybe that one into there. And there we go. I have a four part table down there now. You can have some fun with these Easter eggs. You really could. Uh, placing them around in different positions and then uh, adjusting the design slightly. Uh, you can be very creative indeed. Mm -hmm. Right, a traditional Egyptian food called kushir, which I love to have with Japanese sauce. Okay, right, so we just got a new food into the chat. So, Krishi, let's go have a look at this one since you've mentioned it. I'm always interested in learning about new food as well. And I need to show you the Easter Kit Kats for Luanda. So Easter Kit Kats for Japan. Okay. Now we have a variety of different Easter Kit Kats. It depends on the context of the Kit Kats. So let's give you some example articles. So Luanda, you've got the bunny ones down there, which are very nice. They're the banana Easter ones. There's also this one down here, which is the carrot and apple pie flavor combo. Uh, oh my God, like really, 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 Ricky. Uh, so very nice. So look at that. So, very, 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 very good. That was a 2015 one, by the way. So, yes. So, carrot and apple pie combination shake. Very good indeed. And you can see down ones, there's like um, this one down here, which is the banana one as well. There are quite a few different pictures. And if we have a look at the imagery for Easter Kit Kats in Japan, you can see some of the examples. These ones down here look like bunny ears. So there you go, Lawanda. Look at that, bunny ear ones. <laughs> they look like little rabbit ears, and they were so cool. Yeah, banana caramel. Okay, carrot with apple pie down there as well. 
uh, because it's spring as well you might get sake flavor you might get a uh, sakura I had some sakura ones yesterday there's the banana caramel down there um, so very 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 nice indeed so yes Easter does have some good ones let's see for 2024 what did they do let's have a look What's their latest one? Mm -mm -mm. Oh, too many good choices. Too many good choices. Right. You don't have those flavors. No. I got asked yesterday, why don't I start sending them overseas and then people can buy them from me? So let's go to Kushri. Let's have a look at this one. So K U S H R I. Kushari, okay, here we go. Or oh, Koshari. Kushari, uh, Egyptian dish, okay, Koshari. Do 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 do. Oh, that looks nice. No, that. Ah, that looks nice. Oh, I like the look at that one. Mmm, I could eat that. That looks good. Look at that. It looks like pasta in there as well. So pasta, meat, and other bits and bobs all mixed together. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. I would definitely eat that one. And they give me a spoon as well, which is nice. I could munch through that. I like the look of that. I do. I do. That is very nice looking. Mm. Right, okay, let's have a look at what we've got in the chat again. Ricky might come next year. Can, MX says, can someone please give me a farm pass? Sorry I'm to ask. I'm not begging, by the way. I'm sorry. Uh, I do giveaways for farm passes on my live stream uh, every quarter. So my next farm pass giveaway will be Tuesday. Uh, if you join my Tuesday stream, you might be lucky. You may not be lucky. So your best option is just to join did Japan have the Grimace's Purple Birthday Milkshake? What the hell is that? Huh, one more time. So, do 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 do. G R I M A C E. The Grimace Purple, P U R P L E, uh, Milkshake. Japan, let's have a look. Uh, these ones, I think we did, I'm not sure, maybe, we might have had them, not sure though, so did Japan have it, okay, no, we had a different one, we had the purple shape, which is potato, not grape, It's not grape flavor. Uh, it is a different one. So this is the one that we had. Strictly, this is our one. This one. But um, this one's not. Um, it's um, different. <coughs> oh yeah, I like the look of that one. Do 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 do. It's sweet potato which is very nice indeed so made from this which is much much better and I mean much much better so sweet potato is good I love sweet potatoes I really do so not grape flavor sweet potato flavor <gasps> look at that I could enjoy that one and our milkshake machines work they're not broken and they are really good and you need good suction power so <laughs> Yes, very much so. Oh, yes. So, stir it around and then like uh, suck it up there, get it in there. Mm. So, I did have one of those. They were nice. Right, what are we going to chat? I haven't been to McDonald's so long. I've made the baked burgers. I won't go. I wish the US had those. Strong grape flavor. Yeah, we have a sweet potato. 
Thank you, Vicky. Ooh la la. Yeah, we're lucky in Japan with the Kit Kats. I shared some nice links to some videos yesterday as well for people to have a look at as well. Yes. Nada said grilled onions, hot chili sauce, and tomato sauce. That one was nice, that koshari. I'd like to try that one. Okay, well in relation to merging the tables, you can see there I've merged um, one, two, quite a few tables together. And the design's not so bad looking. I like that. I think I could have fun with those tables. Tenea, hello everyone, by the way. All right, now I just spent a load of coins, which I wasn't too happy with. Tables are now done. Let's have a look at the doors. But well, the doors are regular as usual. Nothing special from the doors that I want down there. Next one is the wall pieces. There's nothing new been added in there that I want to get, and I've got plenty of those already to keep me going. Yeah, so windows. Windows are very nice, but they cost vouchers, and I do like these basket ones, but it's the vouchers. We have some weird flavors in the USA. Oh, I'd still like to try them, Pete. I'd still like to try them. Um, I think most countries have different ones. Mm. The Grimace shape reminded me of the grape flavored medicine for kids. Okay, maybe it was medicine. You never know what they're putting in your food these days. Yeah. But I do like the windows on this as well. Some good ones down there, but vouchers. Mm -mm -mm. The Marshmallow Bunny Divider. Oh, we've got to do this one. Let's have a look. Joins together as a beautiful fence style piece as well. Um, I suppose if I wanted to merge it together, it would be better on that side. So, because there's a bit of a gap between it. So, glitching those together would look better. Okay, let's do it. Let's see what we can do here. So, we're going to glitch. Copy that one again over into there. There we go. Let's edit the layout on this one. Take the machine back away. Let's have a shifty. Mm. I think many countries have weird flavors or flavors that you're just not used to, which is the key thing. Mm. Right, so we want to bring that one into there. There we go. Copy that one over. Copy that back into that one. There we go. Edit that one. There's the machine. Put that back into storage for the moment. Come back down again. Find that piece there. Bring it back over onto there. X that one out. Come back. Bring that piece down. Oh, it's not going to work for me. Why? Okay, did I break the glitch? I think I did. Oh my god, I hope not. Mm -hmm. How's everyone today? Said Tanea. Pretty good. We've just been talking about some food as usual, which we always do. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. There we go, that's better. Oh, you end up with the cross style effect down there. Actually, that's not so bad looking, is it? That could be fun to join some pieces together going across wise. You could make that very interesting indeed. Oh, I could enjoy that one. Making some pieces where they go angle to each other could be a little bit fun. Even extending the fence so they join together. Oh, actually, let me get that so it comes off at the side. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. There we go. There's a bit of a gap that way though, but uh, I could have some fun with this one. Mm. Interesting. Mm. 
Extending it so it joins more nicely together. Definitely better than putting a single piece against it. Yeah, but it's still the same though on that side. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You could do some nice fences there, couldn't we? That could be an interesting one. I'm making quesh for tomorrow and Sunday's breakfast. Yeah. You know what I'd like to have for breakfast? Bubble and squeak. Since I'm looking at vegetables today, uh, it kind of makes me feel like I'd like a nice bubble and squeak for breakfast. I would enjoy that one, I think. So, it's been a while since I've had a good piece. Mm. Okay, let's go see what else we've got new in the decoration I can play with. So we've got the birdhouse down there I've already got. The arbor we've got. Spring arches, vouchers again. Uh, like the garden shed, there's the Easter divider from before, which was kind of cool. And if I put those Easter eggs down in there, maybe I could have a bit of fun with that as well. So, Placing the eggs and then having a little bit of an Easter egg hunt. Um, hmm. I have to think about that one as well. Tulip baskets I've got. The chick fountain's a pretty one as well. The large ferns are nice to grab. There's some natural gardens down there which I do like, but six vouchers for one piece. Uh, considering it's only a four square option. Mm. But it is tempting though, really tempting. Two for the smaller one, for nature's garden, for the red one. I could do a few of those. Uh, the water fountain. Oh, that one's pretty as well. I like the look of that one. That might be worth getting. That one's a nice one. What do you think? Should we do it? That's a pretty one. Mm. And then we've got down there the chair, nature chair, other bits down there. Nothing really new down there. There's a lot of topiary which I haven't bought. And some other pieces. I did like these fences before. So they are good. But I think that's everything down there. Hmm, the watering can's a good one to have. Okay. So just those bunny fences. Hmm. Hey, put that back away. Okay, let's see the indoor decoration. Now, indoor decoration where we've got some new ones as well. We've got a cute little bunny armchair. And you know what? I'm really tempted to get this one. So you've got cute little ears on the back part of that as well. And that, that I'm doing that one, sorry. That's going to be expensive for me. Uh, one silver, two gold. But it's a gotta be get that one. Yes. Mmm. Some other pieces down there, very nice indeed, but do I want anything? No, 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 no. Right, that's those ones. Let's look at the specials. <gasps> we got the specials! We've got the sweet lamb, yummy. We've got the golden lamb, yummy. We've got the half hatch chick. Yummy. I could enjoy eating that one as well. Okay. Uh, we've got the baby alpaca. Cool. We've got the Easter bunnies. Uh, we've got the pink bunny as well. We've got the chicks. Mm -hmm. We've got the cockatiel. And then there's this brand new spring fox, which I haven't purchased yet, which is actually quite large. So that's quite a big one as well. So we'll hold off on that one. So today you've got quite a few animals, if somebody wants to win one of those. Um, Fee, hello Phoebe, my dear, how are you? Can't stay, I've been doing man work here. Really? 
So, unclogging the drains, painting the walls, carpentry, uh, changing the oil in the car, fixing a flat tyre, uh, vacuuming, ironing, cooking. Uh, which role, my dear? Which role? If necessary, I can give you some tips on how to do it as well. Especially the ironing. I'm good at ironing. I really am. Yeah. Yes, indeed. He spent 3k today on woodworking tools and I have to assemble the stands. I could give you tips. We could probably give some tips to each other. Yes. He spent $3,000 today on a woodworking tools and I have to assemble the stands. <laughs> he did the difficult part. Yeah. I was using some woodworking tools at the weekend to cut some logs for the fire. Or not the weekend, Wednesday. It was good. We did break the saw though. In fact, we broke two saws that day. Um, yes, we did. Gonna have to buy some new ones. Mm, oh, I won't. My friend will. But that's nice, Phoebe. That's nice. You're making the stands for the tools. Yay. So he buys the tools and you get to use them to build. That's cool. He bought a planner and I have to put the stand up for him. How much do you think you should charge him? I think one session at the Esther Salon, VB. So you need to get a facial massage, a scalp massage, a shoulder massage, back massage, leg massage, uh, spine massage, foot massage, finger massage. Uh, and then there's the oil work afterwards as well. Uh, just to make the body more supple and young feeling again. Uh, and then there's the steam session as well, uh, followed by the manicure for the nails, uh, and maybe a, a new haircut as well would be good. Uh, maybe leg waxing, uh, maybe you can have a Brazilian wax as well if you want to go the whole way. Uh, afterwards maybe you can sit down and relax in uh, the hot tub. Uh, drinking some nice uh, pina coladas or something like that uh, then maybe a nice little lunch with uh, daughters or friends or something like that uh, I think that sounds about right so what do you think hmm. I like the Cadbury bunny commercials too yes Reese's eggs. I prefer the Cadbury's eggs. I do. Yeah. Well, you know Easter's around the corner, Pete. So Easter's always good for food talk. Yeah. I do miss the Easter eggs we used to have in the past. So they were fun indeed. Now, those are those decoration. For the other decoration, we've got cake down there. Which is interesting. That requires one of uh, the carrots, and it is nice. And you can upgrade it and make it bigger and better. A stove and marshmallow eggs. Okay, I've got to check this one out now. So, stove and marshmallow eggs. I don't know those ones, I don't think. Stove and marshmallow eggs. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, look at that. Mm. Oh, that looks nice. That looks nice. Ingrid, hello, by the way. That does look good, doesn't it? <gasps> they do look nice. But is it really an egg? It looks like half an egg. Mmm. -hmm. 
I can't tell you, Peter, not yet. But that does look good, doesn't it? I could eat that now. Mmm, yummy, 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 yummy. Mmm, okay. Oh, there's the Cabris ones down there. So, in fact, they are Cabris, aren't they? Mmm. You've got caramel flavour down there. You've got marshmallow, caramel marshmallow. You've got egg marshmallow. Um, okay, you've got different flavours. Oh, look at that one. Look at that one. And it says, a girl taste. <laughs> so you've got chocolate crepe, cream, dark chocolate cream. You've got marshmallow and caramel and vanilla and chocolate cream. Ooh, is this a nice game? It is a nice game to play, Ingrid, yes, but it just takes time, that's all. Uh, it is fun, so I like it. Mm. Daisy put me in prison for having another girlfriend at a car. Uh, Peter, girls don't sometimes um, when you flirt with one girl it's okay because they don't feel they're a threat but when you flirt with someone who's young bubbly sexy attractive then they start to feel threatened and then they think they're not attractive or beautiful enough so you gotta be very careful if you're going to flirt with someone make sure that she sees the new person with the filter on so doesn't look as attractive so they feel that there's no threat and then everything is okay and then vice versa Ricky will eat live octopus hey they were dead they just didn't know it at the time so that's what it looks like on the inside eh? where is it it's gone where's that picture go there's the Cabri's ones that I really adore those are the best ones oh my god they are really 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 really, really good those are the best uh, and that's the one, that's the marshmallow one. Interesting. I would eat that one too. I would. I would like that. I would definitely try those. So it looks like I need to go to Walmart in the UK, in America and see if I can find some of your Easter egg snacks. That's probably the best place to get cheap things, I think. But then again, Cadbury's cream eggs, you can't really beat those. Those are the best ones. So, Cadbury cream eggs. Oh, yes. Look at those. Now, those are the better ones. That is fantastic. Look at that. Mm. Oh, yeah. Uh, I would go in there with that one. Right, Phoebe said, but then, uh, okay, i got to go tighten up 32 nuts on the damn stand. Well, Phoebe, good luck with the nuts. Okay, um, you might be nutty after you finish with that one, but you take care and I'll see you next time. So, oh, yum, 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 yum. Mm. Yes, 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 indeed. Yes, indeed. Oh, my God. Beautiful. Mm. I would enjoy those. Don't break a nail. <laughs> but I'll be glad when my life gets back on the right track. Yes. Yeah, don't break a nail, obviously. So you've got to be careful with the manicure. So definitely after you finish, uh, your husband should be paying for a nice session down the S there. So go and get uh, the massage and everything else that's done and dusted. Treat yourself. And speaking of don't breaking a nail, I better start setting up for my giveaways for today, hadn't I? Right, so we need to do a food street giveaway, and this is for the Hoppy Spring event, and we are in March 2024. We need to give away interactive decoration, we need to give away a pet, we need to give away uh, gold. 
times 1,000. One, two, three people. We need to give away uh, voucher packs. One, two, three, four. Uh, we need to give away gems times 25 each. One, two, three, four, five, I believe. Yep, 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 yep. Yes, okay, so let's do the first one for today. All right, we go open up Nightbot. We come to Nightbot Services, and Nightbot, you are going to be doing a giveaway today. And I think everybody is going to know what the first answer is going to be. Hmm. Do 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 Ricky 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 What happened to the Heyday Weekly events? I haven't had the chance to upload it last night. By the time I finished my stream and then got back home, uh, I was tired. I actually went to bed very early again last night. So two days in a row now, I've hit the bed before midnight. And I feel much better in the morning, uh, but I'm still tired now, as you can see. So I'll get it done later once I've had a chance to do this. So just waiting. So I'll get it done after this stream. Let's go get some greens while I'm at it. So I'm using my blues. There we go. Lovely. That's enough for the moment to keep me going. Now I can open up that slot and we can get a third one on the go. Yay! Mm. Yeah, I did sleep. I woke up once last night and I woke up this morning because my youngest was going to school for basketball practice. So even though school is now finished, she still has to go to basketball club. So. Yeah, I'm not happy with his school. So my son does basketball club for the school. So that means he goes to the school. He's in the basketball team for the school team. And they do basketball practice. Um, he was doing basketball practice. And during the practice, um, I think he did the dunk on the basket. Uh, and as a result, the basketball ring got broken. So the school feels that um, he has to pay for it. And I'm like, no, 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 no. This was a school club activity on school grounds doing practice for basketball, practicing a basketball based activity for a school club activity. This is a school event. You should not make kids pay for equipment that breaks during school activities, during the, the process of doing school activities. So either the equipment is old or already damaged. Um, so, but either way, they should still have insurance to pay for their own bloody equipment. I'm not paying for new basketball hoops. No way. Disputed that one. If he was messing around and doing stupid things, I would understand. But then I would be comfortable with paying. But no, 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 no. This was an official basketball club activity during basketball club time, so covered as far as I'm concerned. If the kid purposely breaks it, then they have to pay for it. But if it's just an accident through regular practice and training, then it's different. Um, so yes. So if they purposely break it, Pete, then no, you're you're liable. Mm, I sleep during the day most of the time myself. Yeah. I don't want to sleep during the day. I like to get up early. Maybe I did too much hard work the other day, but I don't think so. I only did some gardening and chopping of wood, which was good fun. Shelley says I take little naps. I'm tempted to start doing that now that I'm getting older. Mm. But I prefer to go to a coffee shop and relax and read a book and just chill out there without sleeping. Mm. 
Right, now we need to do the giveaway. So good luck everybody. Now Ingrid, you asked if the game is good fun. It is good fun to play. Uh, slow and leisurely and not overly stressful sometimes. But good luck building up the coins because you keep spending and decorating. Trust me on that side. Uh, plus also this game has the ability to glitch and combine decoration which makes it more fun as well too sometimes. Mm, I'm reading a good book, yeah. Ingrid said, what happened to the Heyday weekly events calendar? I haven't updated mine yet. I'll do it later today after, the, after we finish here. Um, so they post theirs every Sunday. Um, and we're not allowed to post until 9 p.m. Um, Friday night. But uh, when I got back last night, I was tired, so I didn't do it. So uh, once I get it done, I will post it. So after the stream, I'll go and sort it out. Okay, everybody, here's your first clue. This is your first one, everybody. So here is your first question. What Easter sweet were we all salivating over? Type the answer into the chat. So what Easter sweet were we all salivating over? So yes. <laughs> right, what do we got to do next? Okay, I got trees and things still to chop down. Don't have the saws on that one yet, so I don't need to stress it for the moment. Let's just keep focusing on the event. That's my better choice for this one. <laughs> I do chuck the bunnies next. <coughs> so who's going to type the answer into the chat? If you get this one right, everybody, I need to give you uh, voucher packs. So I need four winners on this case. So what would you choose, I wonder? Mm. We've got some answers down there. Christmas sweets. <laughs> Well, it's funny to say that, Pete, but I would eat the Easter eggs for Christmas as well because they're much cheaper during that time because the price goes down. During the Easter period, the prices are crazily expensive, but uh, during uh, Christmas, they're definitely much cheaper, which is nicer. So uh, I would definitely support that. So yes, 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 yes. We got Cadbury's eggs, cranberry eggs, cranberry eggs. I'm not so sure about cranberry eggs, but I think I'd like to give that a go as well. Chocolates, okay. Kit Kats, mm -hmm. Cadbury eggs, uh, Cadbury eggs, okay. Uh, love holiday candles, candies. So do I. So do I. So do I. Give me chocolates any time, and I'll be happy. The chocolate selection here is very diverse, but it's very Moorish. You get one, you start nibbling, and the next thing you know, you finish the whole pack and they're gone. And you're like, oh no, where did they all go? And I've kind of like lost them. And it's like, no, I want to eat them again, but they're all gone and I ate too many. And oh my God, what should I do? Kind of thing. So um, terrible feeling. <laughs> No, it's not. It's a wonderful feeling. 
but not when you run out though because you want more we need 12 more for the next star so we're going to blitz this one and get some more there we go Beautiful. And I need 504 on that one. Long way to go yet. Long way to go. There we go. Get the creams. Right, Chelly Riley said Kit Kats. Kit Kat said Pete as well. Kit Kats are good. I'm thinking more of the Easter ones. So, what did we choose? What were we looking at with the beautiful pictures? Yeah. Actually, that would be a good one to go check as well. So, let's have a look. So, we were looking at the eggs. So, best Easter eggs. Mm -mm -mm. Damn, there are some good pictures down there. Do -do -do -do, do -do -do -do. Okay, let's have a look. Two days ago. Luxury Easter eggs. Ah, uh, look at that one. That looks lovely, doesn't it? Oh my god, I would lick the center out of that one. I would. And you got little mini ones too. The Burley Bakery Golden Crunch Egg. Mmm. There's probably more chocolate in the base piece than there is in the egg itself. That's the thing that always bugged me about Easter back in England. Like, you get this beautiful Easter egg, and it was so expensive. But if you buy a chocolate bar, which is a fraction of the cost, there's more chocolate in the chocolate bar than there was in the Easter egg. It was all packaging and decoration. And I was always disappointed. That's why I like the Cadbury's eggs, because I didn't mind paying for that, because they felt like they were substantial. But um, the, the pretty Easter eggs with the boxes and the little buttons in the bottom and bits like that, it's always overpriced and minimal chocolate so they say going to get bad storms on Saturday Sunday night well make sure you batten down the hatches get some supplies in and blankets in case you need to keep warm we've got thunderstorms now and rain says Pete oh, okay Charbon now uh, air walker milk chocolate egg wow that chocolate eggs all wrinkly so, um, not smooth. That would have been painful coming out. So imagine the poor chicken that had to lay that one. So all the wrinkles and rivers are like, oh, ah, oh, oh, as it's trying to pop out. Like, no, no, there's no smoothness about that one. No. Oh, look at that. Oh, my God. Rosewood almond blossom Easter egg. That is fancy. I would eat that. I would pick those flowers off and nibble on those. I do like the decorative sweets they have out here as well. Mm, Fortnum Masons. Yeah, that one's nice. Bit boring. But uh, still very nice. Hand painted. Yeah, that's more like it. Now that I think would be okay. I think that's the winner so far. So extra thick egg, uh, tipsy. Uh, half 40% milk, half 70% dark piled high with tipsy truffles. Each made with generous glug of the real thing. Ooh. I think that's a winner. That one is the best one so far from all of those because you get the truffles on the inside as well. Yes, 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 yes. That's the one I want to go for. Mm. £29.45. p. Holy smoke. Like, wow. How much is £29.45 p now? Hang on, so... Uh, pounds to yen 
So twenty nine pounds, twenty nine pounds, forty five p, five thousand yen. Shit! Wow! 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 Not good. Not good indeed. Not good indeed. Mm. <gasps> wow! <sighs> okay, Hales and Cocoa Cream Meg. Those look interesting, but what they like on the inside, though? Mm. It has hazelnut cocoa cream filling with crunchy layers of milk chocolate and studded with chopped hazelnuts. Okay, that could be interesting. Okay, milk chocolate ocean egg. Ah, <gasps> that one's pretty. Oh, we have to come back to this in a moment, I think. Let's do your giveaway while you're watching all of it. So you can probably guess the answer from this one. Definitely eggs. Right now, uh, let's see who typed in the right answer. What is the sweet we're salivating over? Tanea said Cadbury's eggs. She's in this one, which is good. Christmas sweets, no. Eggs said Shelly, even though she said uh, cranberry. I'll accept that. Uh, Peter said Cadbury's eggs, okay. Lawanda said eggs, okay. Uh, Ingrid's here, but she didn't answer. Anybody else in the chat? You can type in the answer, by the way. Right, first winner <coughs> is going to be Luanda. Okay. You're going to get uh, a voucher pack. I only need four winners. Next one down there is uh, Peter. You get a voucher pack as well, sir. Do 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 do. Tanea gets a voucher pack as well, and I've got one more to give away. So here we go. Strictly, congratulations as well. You get a voucher pack. There you go. Cancel that one now. The answer I chose, by the way, was eggs, everybody. So, um, eggs was the correct answer in this case. Mm. Oh, these are good. I like this. These are very nice indeed. Mm. I might share this page later so everybody can enjoy this one because there were some nice bits on that one. Yummy, 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 yummy. Price-wise, those. Yeah, they're the best ones. Cadbury's mini eggs, they're good. Thorntons I like. Oh, they include the chocolate pieces as well. Lit, that would be good to have. Okay. Mm. Yeah, Tony's Colony Chocolate. Don't know this brand. Blood Orange, oh yeah, Marks and Spencer's collection. Ah, Marks and Spencer, that's luxury. Look at the shape of that diamond egg. Oh, those are good. Wouldn't you like that one? I want them all. Oh, I do, Peter. I do. Some of these look really, really, really nice. Yes, very nice indeed. Very nice. It would cost you an absolute fortune, though, to have all of those. That's the only problem. Right, let's type in the code. So, Lawanda, I've got down there. Do I have her details? Yes, I do. Good bites, level 57, club one player in peace. I can copy that one over. Do, 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 do. Peter, I need his details too. His is Wizards in level 36. Yep, got that one. Mm -hmm. Tanea, I need her details too. Let's have a look. Break the fast, she says. I can type that one straight in, that'll be easier much faster than coughing sometimes. 
So break the fast. And that's level da -da 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 20. LVL 20. Strictly said, who wants a voucher pack can have mine. Hmm? Okay. So Strictly, what doesn't want her voucher back? Who wants her voucher bags? Say now or forever hold thy peace. She's given it to you. So Strictly says, if you want it, come and grab it. It's there. And she's offering it up to you. So take it, take it, take it. I would. Who wants a voucher pack? Voucher packs include blue vouchers, bronze vouchers, silver vouchers, and gold. And they're all free of charge from the game company. So, in fact, uh, Ingrid, if you've downloaded the game, you could have it. Shelly says she'd take them. Okay, Shelly's got first dibs on that one. So, we'll change it, and Shelly will have them. Okay, there you go. First come, first served. Shelly Ryder will take those. So, okay, I will do so strictly. Thank you very much for entering and for winning and for donating. So, Shelly is level 26, Angels Amongst Us. Twenty-seven now. You've upgraded your farm and restaurant design. Why am I saying farm? Your restaurant. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. Lovely. Done and dusted. You're now there on the board. And the answer was eggs, by the way. It was eggs. Now, these are my animals. Let's feed those and get those moving around. Since it is Easter, we might as well. That's why I need the carrots. I got the alpaca down there as well. Somebody sitting in the chair, really. We need a lot of veggies down here. I could upgrade some of these as well. What would the upgrade one look like, I wonder? Hmm. Do you know what? I'm going to upgrade with six bronze vouchers. Don't always do this, but they are livestock animals. And they are cute sometimes, so let's do it. One, two... <gasps> Got to wait 11 hours and 59 minutes for the next one. So, no. Or we can spend 12 diamonds and see what it looks like now. So, let's spend the 12 gems and speed that one up. There we go. We've now got a upgraded animal, everybody. So, yay. There we go. Is that it? Is that it? It doesn't look any different. It's just more XP. Like I was expecting something more beautiful. Like I just upgraded that one. And that's all it does for me. Like uh, nothing. It does, doesn't make it any more beautiful or more interesting. It's still the same. Um, oh no, it has different flowers on it, so there we go. Let's bring them both down. I'll buy another one as well. We can see the difference. There we go. That's the difference between the two. Um, flowers or no flowers? That's my choice with the two. So flowers or no flowers? That's the difference. There we go, there we go. And I need to buy the path pieces, don't I? So we haven't done this one yet. Let's go do that. One, two, and three. So these are the new bunny path pieces. There's one.
There's two. There's three. Okay. Plus we've got the existing ones as well down there, which are like the spring tiles. You've also got down there the blue spring tiles as well. Then there's the flower tiles as well. And then we've got down there the pinwheel tiles. And then we've got down there the cobblestone tiles as well. So those are my choices. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Right. Okay, I've donated them to Shelley. I have done. Congratulations on that one. Enjoy. Mushrooms. Yeah. Carrots, there we go. Carrots are done again. Let's do more. Need lots of carrots. One, two, three. Beautiful. And everything else is now up and running and on its way around. Yay. <coughs> okay, next one again. Open up a slot for later. Start doing the chocolate bunnies now. We need more of the Easter spice as well. This merchant always is the slow bottleneck for me. It really is. I was actually contemplating the other day to open up more land instead. So I've got this piece down here. And I've got the gems now, so I could do it. I've got the coins, I could do it. So should I do it or not? That was my thought. I was thinking to do or not to do. And we've not got enough gem pieces down there to make that one viable. But I could do closer with some of these. But um, as you can see, I already did them. And they take ages to get the resources. So, yes, yes, yes. But the land I was definitely thinking about. There were some nice options down there. And I have the gems for it. So I could upgrade. The new open land over there, I'm close as well. Only 165 gems on one of those, and I could do that as well. So, what do you think? Should I open up some land and then use all of my coins once more again? <laughs> yeah, my poor coins. So, this slot. Or the other slot. I wish I could keep the rocks, though. Mm, still a lot of coinage I need to get all of those done. A lot of pieces to be opened. But uh, So one, two, three, four more pieces of land. Thinking about changing my pick since it's hard to see. Mm, well, all the pictures are hard to see on this one. All picks are hard to see. That one's now done, which is beautiful. That's more blues, which is nice. I like that. Can't do anything until I get to the next milestone. All of the slots are opened up, which is good too. <laughs> yeah. So what would you change your picture to? That's the question. What are you going to go for? 
What's your picture preference choice? <laughs> 19 minutes on the hem, going to be just about right for the next one, so perfect. Get those on the go for later. Yeah, takes one of those. I got the squids to do, so we get that one done too. I can do the lobster now because I've got one cream down there as well. Right. I better get some wheat made first though. Do 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 that's good. <laughs> Don't know yet. Um. So, since your name is Shelley Ryder, what could we do as a good picture for you? Let's have a look. Maybe not such a good idea to go with those Shelly Ryder ones. <laughs> How about this one, like scrunching your hair up, so like, ah, kind of style. But different spelling on the name. Uh, there's the sexy ones down there. So my best friend, Daddy, I don't think they're the best ones. Let me correct the spelling on this one. I always like looking sometimes, you never know. Oh, R-Y-D-E-R. -E there we go. What can we do down there? There we go. How about a beautiful black horse? That'd be good. <coughs> Uh, I have two Shelly Riders in the chat now. Or you've changed the picture. I don't know. Did you change your picture, or is that a different person? So, how about a horse? That'd be good. Mm. Oh, how about one of those? Yeah, that'd be good. Mm. Yeah, there's nothing funny or interesting associated with your name, is there? Let's just get rid of the Shelly and do a rider. Let's see what it comes up with. Okay, you got a cartoon character down there. That could be good. You could be named after the brand company. Or, how about something like that? Using uh, your letters with a black and red logo. Mmm, there we go. Yeah, you could be the Ryder Cup, we could do a trophy picture. <coughs> How about a bicycle? That could be good. Or a pair of boots. There we go. That would be perfect. Then you could be friends with Peter. Have one boot and you can throw the other boot at Pete. They are Pete. They are. Pictures are hard to see on YouTube. Very much so. I agree on that side. It's very difficult to come up with logos or icons. Very much. Hmm. My one's easy. It's very distinctive in some way. So not so bad. If I type, same with your tree, very distinctive, very easy to see. So a single object or single color pattern is very much so. I have my son, my, uh, I have my son has my picture. Okay. Family pics are good. Okay, 
I can now make more of those uh, wheat and those pieces. I need this one next. Carrots again. Let's get carrots on the go. There we go. Lovely jubbly. I've got another one down there taking us closer. Still need more greens and vegetables. Yeah. This is a green veggie game. I like my train colours. I like it too. It's very distinct and very you. So, why did you choose it, Pete? Why did you choose that one, if I might ask? Because it is a cool logo, and I do like it. It got cold again. Ouch! Oh, that was a good crick. It's often interesting to hear why people chose their logos or their designs. To, it makes you wonder. <laughs> Finish my prayer. Did I miss the giveaway? You did, Nada. Yep. We gave away dinner for two at a Yakiniku restaurant. Uh, we also talked more about delicious food um, for Easter and bits like that. Uh, we looked at uh, different kinds of uh, Easter eggs and bits like that. So, yes. Um, it's been raining here today, so it's uh, the temperature is chilly. And um, there's a bit of like a humidity in the area, so things are damp. It's supposed to be spring supposed to be spring but I can't believe how lucky you were yesterday like uh, there we were me eating Kit Kats on the stream and um, and then uh, you get that palm pass giveaway <laughs> that was funny that was funny Fifty six here, okay. I've only done one giveaway, yes. The one giveaway, which was for uh voucher packs. You wanted a picture with many colours in. Okay, that's good. I like many colours too, Pete. Depends on the situation, though. So it depends on the situation. So. If Peter won, I'll take it from him. <laughs> no, let him keep his own prize. You go for your own. No, 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 no. I need some eggs soon or I'm going to be in trouble if I get requested on those chocolate souffle. So when they come I can make getting a bit risky on that side definitely. Well there's the first box done which is nice. Milestone reach which is good. We can take another one down there which is more gloves which is nice. How are we doing in the shop? Yeah, we've got some nice little animals over there this time. There is the little lamb, which would be cool. The bunny I'm not so interested in. Uh, oh, there's a pink cow. <gasps> one twenty forty-five. I could do that one now. I could. I could get myself a new cow. I've got the resources for that one. Oh, I like that one. 
Yes, 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 yes. Do, 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 do. Go now. Where we go? Baby cow. We just bought ourselves a baby cow. Look at that. That's definitely worth that. <coughs> mm. So, that item's now been purchased. New item in five days and ten hours. Oh, I like that one. There we go. We got a baby cow. Yay. Do I have any other cows in there as well? Let's have a look. <coughs> No, go back over special um, this one I want do I have any other cows I do I got some other cows as well for my collection there we go look at that it's beautiful I think that's all the cows I've got now Let me double check. <coughs> I got the little lamb over there, a white one as well, which is cute as well. Already got the similar color scheme. <coughs> Baby cows, only more baby cows down there <coughs> that I purchased. No, nope, that's it. There's the other lamb. There we go. So, why was that lamb not included in those ones? That's because it's a sweater lamb, that's why, different style. There we go. I got three baby cows now. There's the brown one, and then there's the black and white one. So, yay! This is going to be busy for everyone next weekend. Ooh, pink cow, I want strawberry milk, please. Well, I've got the three milk styles, Peter. So, I've got the pink one for strawberry milk. I've got the brown one for chocolate milk. And I've got the white one for uh, white milk. So, uh, but actually that one's white and black, so I'm not sure what colour milk that would be. So, um, mm, have to decide on that one later. So, maybe white and black? Mm, what colour would that be? Probably just a light black colour. But yes, 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 yes. I don't mind spending those tokens on animals sometimes. Because they enhance the farm feel of my restaurant area, which I do like. We can get the Neapolitan milk, cookies and cream. Actually, let's go and have a look at that one. That'll be an interesting topic to look at as well. So, uh, different kinds of milk. Let's go do it. Yeah, we have different kinds of milk. Damn! Wow! Your milk stores are just as diverse as my one. Which one do I get? Which one do I drink? There are so many different flavors and variations. When I was a little boy, it was easy. Uh, you just went with the colors of the milk bottle top, and that told you what kind of milk it was. Now, these days, there are so many different variations, like cow milk is milk. So milk from a cow is okay. Milk from soya and coconut, that's not milk. That's just a weird thing. So, different kinds of real milk. 
There we go. What's this one? Okay, this looks interesting. What's this one? Can I save the picture? There we go. So according to this, we've got some milk-style guides down there. In our own, in our day, we had our own cow. We did, yes, we did. And you'd have to go milk it. So goats as well. So skim milk. So 80% calories, 0%, 0 percent, zero grams of fat, 12 grams of carbs, 11 grams of sugar, and 8 grams of protein. 1%, 2%. Ah, uh, what's the difference between one percent and two percent? Like really, uh, the difference is five or well, two point five kilograms in fat and uh, twenty calories more. <laughs> As if that's going to make a difference, right? There is something shows in your background. I thought my screen on TV is broken. Really? Something shows in my background. Right, well, let's take away my camera. Okay. Take away my quick time. Ah, like here. I think that is down to my green screen. There we go. You can see it on both sides. That should be gone now. So just here, there was a little notch in here. Not so that one. There you go, Nada. I think that's just down to my green screen. Either that or there's a monster in the room and I didn't know about it. So come and join the stream. If you are, if there's ghosts, schools, goblins, come and say hello on the stream. My viewers would like to talk to you. My sister had cows. She did. Um, I like watching the farming videos on TikTok. I learned so much about them as well, which is rather interesting. Whole milk down there. Okay, so real milk. Soy milk. What the hell is soy milk? Coconut milk. That's not milk. Coconut. That's not milk. That's like... Um, you no. Know. Almond. Silk protein. What the hell is silk protein? Oat milk as well. Rice milk. Really? Flax. Walnut. Hemp. Macadamia. Hazelnut. Pea, pistachio and goat milk. No wonder your kids are messed up. Really? You've got all these milk types down there. What's wrong with just regular milk? Oh, we're going to have oat milk or rice milk. You lot are screwed up, you are. So, just get some real milk. That's what the body needs. None of this fake shite. Um, really, 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 really crazy. Just go with regular milk. Just go with regular milk. This is nuts. Yeah. There's milk and then there's not milk. <laughs> Let's have a look. Different types of milk are dairy based and plant based. No. It's already plant based, but it comes from the cow. So, dairy milk is milk from the cow. That's plant-based. They eat plants, they produce milk. Boom! It's already plant-based. Yes. I'm afraid that I broke the screen today when I was cleaning my study. Well, that's not good. Do whole milk, regular milk, thick, creamy. Yeah, real milk. 2% milk is reduced fat milk. Okay. Low fat milk is 2% milk, so it's the same. So 2% milk and low fat milk is the same. What's the difference? Organic milk. Okay. They use organic fertilizers and pesticides. So basically, organic milk is cows eating grass. Okay. Yeah. And they get 30% of the diet from the pasture. Yeah, so only 30%. So 30% of organic milk is organic, 70% is not. Okay. Michelinda is a content creator for Supercell. She is, yes, 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 yes. Michelinda is a content creator. 
So she's one of ours. Hmm. Yep. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Why can't we just have normal milk? What's with all of these like weird and wonderful concoctions? Stop confusing this old man. Ghost of Toshima. Well, there's actually a battleground not far from here where supposedly there's a lot of ghosts. One of my mates used to go ghost hunting. It's tricky milking an almond. I guess it could be. So, like, you got the little teat on an almond and, like, trying to get the milk to come out. Come on, baby, I'm massaging you. Give me some milk. And hello, by the way, Scott. Good to see you here. Yeah. I like milk, I really do. Um, but it does get confusing when I go to the supermarket. Uh, any of the supermarkets there were so many different choices like just which one's the milk I don't want any of this other stuff just which one's the milk Marjanko said I prefer hamburgers over milk okay well how about this one do 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 that was my dinner on Wednesday. Went to my mate's house and we got some nice steaks down there with some chops as well, which was really good. So enjoyed that one a lot. I really did. Very nice indeed. And then we cooked those on the barbecue outside because we were enjoying ourselves there. So there we go on that one look at that yep 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 I enjoyed that evening and then I'm afraid his uh, wife and daughter came home so uh, hmm. look at that that's the fire I, that's all the wood I chopped down and was burning yeah very nice indeed so there we go look at that oh I can feel the heat now. <laughs> I enjoyed stoking that and adding the logs and that. Cutting up all the logs was so much fun. Going up into the woods to find the logs as well. And um, some of the pieces were a little bit too big, so not a problem. And we had this big, like, plastic drum. You can see it in the picture there, so look at that. That plastic drum is literally full of wood. Yeah, beautiful view. I so enjoyed that one. It was really good. Very good indeed. So, yeah. But the potatoes. Now, the potatoes were made with lard. So, he taken uh, the cow fat. Uh, heat it up and melt it down and then saved it and then when it comes to roasting potatoes uh, he boils the potatoes uh, in this case I then put a cup on the top and I shook the potatoes to make them fluffy which is much better that way and then we got some of the the lard so it's all natural fat none of this processed or past fake cooking oil crap that you get so real lard uh, kind of like the fat that you have and then uh, we heated it in the microwave to melt it and then coated the potatoes in that and then put them in the air fryer very 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 good it was really delicious so what's the name what's the name that he called it I forget now Do -do -do -do. Ba -do -ba -do. Do, 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 do. tallow that was it so he said it was called tallow so we he made tallow so beef fat so not lard tallow so we used tallow on that one very 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 good so tallow so not lard tallow lard is pork fat so tallow not pork fat so it was beef tallow sorry so tallow is what we used on it, not lard, tallow. 
very, 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 very good potatoes. And I mean, really good. So ladies, gentlemen, if you want to make some nice potatoes, boil your potatoes, uh, shake them so they become fluffy, uh, melt some tallow, uh, and then mix uh, the potatoes in the tallow, and then put them in the air fryer to cook. Trust me, you will not regret it. You will not regret it. Um, very delicious indeed. And I definitely want to do that again. So get some beef fat. Go to the butchers, get some beef fat on the meat. Don't cut the meat uh, fat off. Uh, turn it into tallow. Uh, you will enjoy completely. Definitely. Right. Mm -mm -mm. I could go for a nice juicy burger. I had a burger yesterday, so don't fancy doing it again today. But I do like burgers though, Peter. But what I fancy now is some more roast potatoes. Mm, I do. I could quite happily munch on some potatoes now. Mmm, Marjango says howdy as well. Americans are weirdos and have given into milk marketing voodoo. Same goes for organic and grass-fed cattle. Yeah, I know. People need to stop believing the crap that they tell you on TV sometimes. That crap they tell you is for the companies to make money out of people being suckers. So... I love here, like I can go to the local farms and they sell vegetables vegetables and produce. We have like vegetable super, or like a farmer's supermarkets here where you can go and buy different kinds of food. And it's very nice indeed. Tastes so much better. Mm -hmm. Much cheaper too, which is the key thing. So for me, saving money is the biggest one. I think I just used all my greens, didn't I? You did, you idiot. That was stupid. Oh well. Burger with lettuce, tomato and onion and pineapple. <laughs> uh, it's funny. They say that hamburgers are bad for you, but when you look at each item individually, each item individually is actually good for you. So what's the difference with really, adding it all together? Yes. Always found that funny. Teriyaki sauce too. I like teriyaki sauce. Yes. No, can't do that one. Yeah, they have a tree problem. Hmm. They need to get some saws, don't they? Grilled pineapple. Mm. My dad used to do gammon with pineapple. Very nice indeed. Ah, I miss my dad. Hawaiian ribeye is delish. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Pineapple pizza is nice. Haven't had that one recently. I've been doing the pepperoni and the uh, margarita and the potato and mayo because it's like 590 yen for a pizza. So, very good deal. At the moment, we've got this green pizza, which is very strange. So, which I'm 
likes the look of, but it looks more like someone's dumped a load of grass on top. Right, I'm going to know another giveaway, everybody. So, let me go and type in my clue for this one and make everybody eligible for this one as well. So, good luck on this. Now, what should I choose? Hmm. It's got to be Easter related. So, what should I do this time? I wonder. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Do, 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 do. Um, we've done Easter eggs. Okay, let me go have a look at something. Uh, I've already been one time, Marjanko. Uh, when I was in London, visiting London, I asked if I could pop in and say hello. And I did visit the team at that time. Um, they gave me some nice goodies as well while I was there and it was good to meet them and I had a little chat with the staff that was there and said hello so it was nice <laughs> but much smaller than uh, the Supercell company so much smaller <laughs> Let's have a look. Do 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 do. Let's do this one, I think. This could be good. I think I've got one. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I've got one. Good luck with this one, everybody. This is going to be a main prize. So whoever gets this one right gets to choose either the interactive decoration or the pet decoration. And it's going to be one word. Shelly, ask me about the A-prom. <laughs> <laughs> Shelly said, my dad passed away a year before my son graduated. Yeah, it's a shame my kids won't get to spend more time with their grandfather in the future, but uh, yes. It's a trouble with listening in another country. Yeah, Clash Mini's gone. If you spent real money in Clash Mini, you can get your refund and then get it transferred to another game. So there's a post on my social media for it, so please make sure you do.
Here we go, everybody. The question is now in the chat. So, uh, what is the Easter Bunny a symbol of? This is your question. Yeah, I miss my mum too. Like uh, her living in England and me living in Japan. You do miss your family. So, what is the Easter Bunny a symbol of? Good luck. One word, everybody. La da da la da la da da ba dum bum 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 do 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 be do be do be do do yeah I got some eggs now which is good mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm mm What have we got down there? So, uh, Oster House, okay, fertility, spring, spring, food, especially chocolates. Okay, keep going. This is for a main item in the game. So, what is Easter, the Easter Bunny, a symbol of? This is your question. What is the Easter Bunny a symbol of? Rebirth says strictly. Fertility said real sportsman. Okay, got some good answers down there. Mm. But what's it going to be? I wonder. What's it going to be? I wonder. Mm -hmm. Do 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 Rebirth says Shelley. Okay, I like that one too. Do do do. Spring down there as well. Okay. Rebirth. We've got a lot of people watching, but nobody's commenting on the chat. So if you want to win an item from the games company, it's all free. You don't have to pay for it. So just type the answer into the chat that you think, everybody. Or maybe people are just listening to the sound of my voice, but they're shy to respond. Don't be shy. It's all good. I'm shy, you don't have to be. Don't know. I thought they used uh, Bilby at first for Easter instead of the bunny. Maybe, maybe, maybe. But uh, the Easter bunny or is, uh, goes back to pagan symbology. Represents certain things there. Remember, a lot of uh, pagan activities were absorbed into Christianity because they wanted to get rid of paganism and make people convert to Christianity. So, a lot of the religious activities that we relate to Christianity don't originally stem from there. Like a rebirth and things like that is not part of uh, original Christianity. But, um, it's interesting. <laughs> but all is good. All is good. Thirty-seven seconds on that one. Peter says, "I don't know." I'm surprised you don't know this one, Pete. 
And speaking of don't know, let's have a little shifty. Did she change her design? We've still got the Estes bar. Come on, young lady, you have to change your design for me. I like to look at new ones. This one's worth an interactive decoration or a pet deco. So, definitely worth answering or guessing. So, what would you choose, I wonder? Pets, we've got the new Spring Fox. Interactive decoration, not so much down there as the cake. But there are other items that are definitely worth getting if you're so inclined for spring. There are some nice little goodies down there as well, so I would probably pick and choose one of those. Right! Um, especially since rabbits don't lay eggs. Yes, they do. Well, they kind of do lay eggs. So, rabbits do lay eggs to a certain extent, or at least the female ones do. So... Just watch two ads without skipping. Oh, were they good ads? I like watching the ads sometimes, especially if I can get something from it. All right, let's go do it. Good luck, everybody. We've got a few winners down there, but who is it going to be? So, uh, making sure everybody who's typed it in is correct. Wow, we have three people with the right answer, but there can be only one winner for this one. So, five, four, three, two, one, and the winner is going to be Real Sportsman with the answer Fertility. Congratulations. You've got the choice of choosing an interactive decoration or a pet of your choice. So, what would you like to go for, Scott? So, which one, which one, which one? You can pick and choose. So, what would you like to choose? It has been a while, yes. No, nada, wasn't you. So, what would you like to choose? Do 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 pet or interactive decoration, which one? Did the give border slides whoever requested last time? I guess so. I think they did. I don't think there was any issues with that last time for getting the water slide. So I don't think there was a problem. If you want the water slide, I can put it down. I think they got it last time. Nobody ever came back and said no. So you want the water slide? So this one, good one to go for. That's a lot of XP. That <laughs> really is a lot of XP. I'd like to get more than one of those actually. So okay, let me put it down. And if there's an issue, then we can always sort it out. But 
Interactive decoration, water slide, not a problem indeed. So yes. Done and dusted. Done 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 done. Okay, I put that one down. So today, so far, for the, I've got a hoopy spring event, hoppy spring event. For the hoppy spring event so far today, interactive water slide, the real sportsman, in Valtapax, Luanda, Peter, Tanea, and Shelley. So, yeah. Yeah, it's a good one to go for. Yeah. They should bring it back. They really should. And maybe give us the option to purchase it. That would be good as well. Another one done down there. We've got to keep going with the resources. So what do I need this time? We need these ones. Okay. Mm. And boy, hello by the way. I've been waiting, wanting that forever. Well, today's your lucky day. That's the good thing about not having so many people watching or answering sometimes, or if my clues are a little bit challenging, uh, it makes it easier to win. So in this case, as an example, according to the Discovery News, since ancient times, eggs and rabbits have been a symbol of fertility, while spring has been a symbol of rebirth. So even though rabbits don't lay eggs, the association of symbols was almost natural. So yes. The Germans introduced it to Pennsylvania. So interesting. What is the Easter Bunny supposed to do? Carried colored eggs and give them toys and gifts to children. Yeah. Easter Bunny, come and visit me. I like eggs and toys, so bring them to mine. I just need more room now. Yeah. Let's have a look. We can revamp your design for you. Yeah, we can do something here. Yeah, you're going to have to glitch them in. Uh, blend it into your uh, London eye. So it glitches in very, very nicely indeed. It does. Uh, or blend it into the, the Ferris wheel. Uh, you can combine those two together and not a problem. Um, so I did mine the other day with uh, the London eye and the Ferris wheel. So they're blended in together. They take up basically a small amount of space and you can modify those and add those together. So you're going to have to glitch them in. You're going to have to blend those together to make it a little bit easier for you. And you know what? I actually am tempted to open up another plot of land. So let's do it. One, two, one, two. And let's do it again. There we go. We've got a new piece of land opened up and some bits to remove as well. So let me move my building back out of the way for the moment. There we go. Um. got some trees that need to be removed with saws as well. Oh, I could leave them in place actually because they are kind of pretty. But uh, yeah, another piece of land and now no coins left. Next one, I need more coins. Oh well. But at least I've got another plot of land done now, so that's good news for me. Karen said, space things up, talk about the movie The Wicker Man. Now that was a good movie. That really was. 
you got to be very careful you really do so whenever you go away to um, investigate things or do things let people know where you're going so if you disappear they know and you don't end up uh, cooked and be careful of uh, beautiful sexy women who offer their body to you free of charge and especially if you decline it so yes 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 Mm. Actually, a good movie, that one as well. There's a new version as well, which is the 2006 one, but the 1973 one. Mm. That's the one I originally watched. Check it out. If you haven't had the chance to watch it, I do recommend it. So, yes. Yeah. They tricked him into coming up to visit. And uh, he tries to stop something. But actually, they... F they tricked him into going and then basically he ended up dying so yes mm -hmm. yeah Yep, so he is the sacrifice. Definitely. Good movie. Recommend it. Right, what have we got in the chat? And hello, by the way, Karen. Okay, good night, everyone. Have fun, says Tanea. Good night, Tanea. See you next time. I didn't show you the screen, did I, actually? Hang on. I've still got the cover up. Okay, that's the movie, The Wicker Man. Check it out. Definitely a good movie. So, and the policeman was the intended victim, if I've just spoiled it for you. But still worth watching. Definitely. <laughs> so, Karen, if you've seen the movie, what was your favourite part of that one, I wonder? We need chocolate bunnies again. So many resources. R rated. <laughs> yeah. I'm not so spicy today, sorry. Not so spicy today. Okay, we've now got my thumbs up badge. That's a few of us who are participating. wonder if we can get anybody else within the team to join in. So let's see, how are we doing at the moment? There's a few people started. Still a lot more still to come. Mm -hmm. Haven't seen a lot of these participate so much recently. But um, people are busy, which is all good. So. Mm -hmm. Don't have that green one, sorry. <coughs> we can be spicy. We can, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Spicy, spicy eggs. So, spicy eggs is a nice option. I like the sound of that one. Mm -mm -mm. Right, because I'm about to go, or very soon, let's take some rice down there, and I'll do some sugars again for those ones. There we go. 
and I'm going to get some of those on the go there for later. I need 421 still on that, which is fine. I got eggs producing down there, which is good, and that will help. We got chicken legs and eggs. We just need to start producing more rabbits. I need my chocolate bunnies to breed. I do. <coughs> I know I have been slacking lately. The whole team's been um, absent sometimes, so yes. But I'm the same. I can't always get that. Peter said, I'm tired from being spicy from all of the streams. I've been tired the past few days. I went to bed early twice now. Um, maybe my Wednesday exercise and uh, socializing drained me of a lot of energy. But I did, oh, I was so relaxed, I really, really was. Bit of gardening work in the morning, just to build up some sweat and um, drinking at the same time as gardening, which was perfect. So I arrived there relatively early in the morning, had a few beers before we started. Um, we dug up a weed crown, which was like the mother of all of the weeds there, that had branched out in different directions that we wanted to clear before. Uh, and then we found some other crowns and we found traced their root system to see where they were spreading. See, the root system was not so bad. It's the crowns that you've got to get because they then usually branch out from that. So we found three more crowns, which are still babies. So we dug up what we could there and he's going to poison those. And then some of his hedgerow is poking through his fence. So uh, we sliced and cut those down, which was nice as well. And then the rain started to come, so we stopped and basically went inside, set the barbecue up, okay, set the fire up, uh, and then went up into the hills and behind his home, got a load of logs, carried those down, chopped those up, got the barbecue and the fire going, just relaxed and drank and ate. Also went down uh, to the local bento place and bought some more beers and uh, some bentos for lunch as well. It's good. I enjoyed myself so relaxed all day. Sometimes work is relaxing, especially when it's not normal work. Um, and I don't mind helping my mates with um, DIY or building or other bits like that because um, I learn new skills. So, yep. <clears throat> Ricky, I want help on my restaurant, please. Okay, so what kind of help, Nada? So, what kind of help? Let's go have a look. What help do you need? You need some rice down there. Well, I've just started growing some rice, so I could probably do that later. What you should have done, instead of requesting the, the greens, you should have requested the rice. That would have been better. Then I could have donated to you. But I've got some rice growing down there now, which will take a couple of hours. You've got plenty of time to do that one, so it's easy to grow the rice. Definitely. You've got lots of time. <laughs> so that won't be a problem for you. chop down a tree now but I will remove these ones first there we go that's better much nicer Got another order down there let's have a look see we're trashed that one chicken udon I could do that one but I need the eggs and the bits first so that's a bit risky but let's get two on the go anyway I get some more eggs from over here in a moment which would be nice Right, Thai, I need the prawns on that one, I don't have, so we'll get rid of that one, don't have that one. That one I do, cream of mushroom soup is in there, that's good. Yeah, shepherd's pie, oh I'd love some shepherd's pie now, I would, but I don't have the chops. Yeah, soup and that I've got, and that I've got fish and chips, I don't think I've got any fish left, have I? No, I don't. But, let's have a look, one down there. Another one later, that'll be good. 
Uh, so no, I don't have the green tokens. Me neither at the moment. Can we buy the water slide in the shop? No, I'm afraid it's only an event one that it comes out. Um, it's not there for sale, uh, which is a shame. But sometimes it comes back. Laurie, hello, by the way. <coughs> If you got blues, then you can buy the green token. So remember, you can use your blue tokens to open this one up. So really, really useful way of getting those extra tokens. So other than requesting, remember, use the blues that you've got uh, to purchase these tokens. And you'll be surprised how many nice ones you can get. So like I just got given a green there as an example. Uh, if I do it again, there's another green one down there. If I do it again, there's another uh, one down there as well. Tap that again. Another two down there as well. Uh, now I'm out of blue tokens. But if I come to my storage, you can see too many of these ones as usual. But they just gave me some nice ones to use. And that's the best way to do it. <coughs> And then when you level up, as an example, uh, you'll be able to upgrade your machines a little bit more, which is nice. And go a little bit faster, which is even better. Oh, that looks nice. Spring chicken. <sighs> like the look of that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can donate one now since I just spent my tokens, but that's the way to do it. Don't care for decorating. Sometimes, Pete. Sometimes, Pete, decorating's fine. Sometimes not. I just broke my design on my uh, other game, so I'll be revamping that one a little bit later. Shelly says, I like decorating. It can be fun. It is very time consuming indeed and does take a lot of time and energy. But it is enjoyable. It just takes time. That's the key thing. So I'm afraid time is sometimes uh, not always in our favor or more important things come out. We know, Peter, where have you seen your restaurant? <laughs> um, are you saying Peter's restaurant needs decorating? <laughs> I think a lot of people don't decorate as much these days because it is very time consuming indeed. When it first started, everybody was decorating left, right and centre, but it takes time, it really does. Okay, 236 more to go, 40 to go, 170 to go, slowly getting there. We will do one day, one day, one day, one day. I'm going to need a way of getting sore soon because I'm running out again. Perfect.
I play it on my phone and it gets so frustrating trying to decorate so that's why mine looks all jumbled. Yeah, well, I do it on my iPad and it's still annoying sometimes. So You start doing something and then you get called away and then when you come back it's like three days later and like the new event starts and like, no, I haven't got time to do that now. And uh, you've got a beautiful idea in your mind. So sometimes it's just easy to keep it simple and then with that simple design uh, just don't modify it so much yeah. and speaking of phones my old iPhone 3GS I think it's finally starting to have battery problems so um, like this morning when I woke up it had powered off and when the alarm rang on me uh, after I powered it back on to see what time it was the alarm rang and then it powered off again so I think I'm starting to have battery issues so that iPhone 3GS I've had for years don't use it as a phone anymore just as an alarm clock now but I think it's starting to move into its end of life phases which is a shame because it's a great device it really was very few problems with it at all and I mean very few problems dropped so many times too and never broken yeah but it's my alarm clock now my 3GS is the one I used to use to make my videos when I first started making videos for Heyday Shame I can't use it anymore, but then again, there's devices like this big, so you imagine playing it in the past, one finger holding it, and then making videos, very different time. iPad's definitely much easier, that's for sure. Okay, right, everybody, I'm going to say thank you very much now for watching me. We're coming up to the end of the stream. So, for the winners, please make sure you do contact the games company. So, in this case, Real Sportsman in the chat down here, my hoodie. Uh, please let me know you won the water slide. Voucher packs, Luanda, Peter, Tenea, and Shelley. And I'll do the rest next time. Uh, Ricky, do you platform other than Netflix to watch CSI Miami? I do use Netflix, but um, I haven't used it for the past couple of days. Last time I watched Netflix, I watched the dungeon animation, which is very, very good indeed, where they eat all of the monsters and make food out of it, which is actually quite fun. I enjoyed that one. But I'm going to say goodbye. Thank you, everybody, for watching me today. Uh, the event is there. You've just got to continue with it. So I will see you next time. Take care, have fun, and enjoy the event. Bye now.